Make you know Ninja songs, old school or new school. Stand a chance to win big on Gusto Gesto song. To be a part of this, call the numbers on your screen right now. Come on board and let's do things the Gusto way. to Gusto News. This is Gusto TV. My name is Ife Oluwa. Uh, this today, yes, on the news, I've got Mayor of Lagos. I also have um, Johnny Drew and as well, we'll be rounding it up with the Titan Queen herself, Tasha. But before I go on, of course, I'll say thank you to you guys for all you do for us. Be it likes, comments, telling people about Gusto TV. We'll see you. Thank you so much. But if you're new to this channel, maybe you've seen our videos for the very first time, please make sure you do not just, you know, watch and go. Please make sure you click on the subscribe button. You can go a step forward by clicking on the notification bell. That will help you know when we put up a new video. So starting off the news with Mayoko, of course, we know that Mayoko, I mean, uh, after his last album, it's just been a collaboration. We've seen a single, your body, and all of that. Yes, he's been doing so much. You know, recently a lot of songs has been on. Turn out to be hit and quite very um, interesting one, well accepted. But fans had consistently asked for more from Mayo. Yes, of course, we know there was a time a tweet was going on. When is Mayo going to put up something else? He responded as at the time saying that. He is working to put out his heart. He wants to make sure that, you know, whatever he's giving us, you know, is worth the wait. But I feel like fans are no longer patient and they just want, like, him to deliver, like, now, now, now. There's a couple of pictures on Twitter, which, of course, are from fans of Mayoko asking, when are we going to get another song from Mayoko? This person is even carrying a placard. Yes, it's just like hitting the streets to protest and ask the mayor of Lagos that what are you waiting for? Yes, this person says, Mayor Alpha, nine months too long, drop music for boys. Okay. Yeah, another one, can see the duo says, uh, Mayor of Lagos, give us new music. Mayor can stop starving. Okay, starving us, give us new music. I mean, if fans are clamoring for something, I feel like it's just time for Mayokun to drop something. Yes, we've seen him in videos, you know, with in the studio. It seems like he's really working hard to make sure that whatever he finally releases to his fans is worth the wait. But I feel like fans are no longer patient. They just want to hear something from Mayokun. Would Mayokun respond to them? Would they give an immediate response by dropping maybe a single or even a project? You know, we don't know, but from fans of Mayokun, they want to hear something from him. And who doesn't want to hear? So moving on to the next one, this one is, uh, of course, the guys from the alternative, you know, side of music here in Nigeria, Johnny Drill. He has been doing a lot of things. And when it comes to, you know, the whole love thing, weddings and all of them, Johnny Joe's name is one of those names that come to mind, you know, when it comes to things that have to do with marriages, emotions, yes. You know, Bad, Dan Bad Dancer was, which he released this year, has done so well. People listen to it, people, you know, of course, were able to relate to that one. But yes, you know, of course, no matter how long an artist continue to drop, maybe a single or EP or something, they definitely will get to a point where they want to drop a major body of work that people can always, you know, refer to and you know go back to listen to consistently and people can generally now say okay this is from this artist here yeah, jindril has gone up on his twitter page to announce that he will be dropping his debut album it says mm -hmm. my debut album before we fall asleep okay what a name will be released on the 3rd of september this gift piece of my heart you would love journey jd okay so yes that name is actually before we fall asleep i feel like the guys from the alternative would have this you know their names are one that makes you think over and over again but yes this is from um johnny julia said that this one will be titled before we fall asleep again so maybe just before we fall asleep it's just going to you know give us something that wakes up us up Oh, so yes, Denji is coming with his debut um, studio album. And of course, we've seen what he could do in the past with songs he has released. So this will definitely not be a miss. Rounding up the news with um, one of those ladies online that gets people talking. She's been in so many controversial, you know, discussion online. 
even offline. Yes, and a lot of times she's one person that has grown a thick skin to come out and respond to people like, what really is going on here? Well, we know the moment, yes, the Big Brother competition, yes, reality show is going on. And this is generating a lot of discussion due to issues that are happening, you know, in the house from somebody had, you know, had advice to leave the show, not, you know, due to some things to, you know, the very tyranny, you know, some things we're seeing and people are relating it to, you know, what's happening in the real world outside here. Well, of course, this person is probably a fan of Tasha who feels like this lady must have really gone through a lot, you know, considering what happened in the house during her own time. And after she came out of the house, the way people were trolling her, if she was able to survive that, then definitely this person feels like she is a very strong person. But someone else comes with a contradicting uh, perspective and she had to come out herself and respond. Yeah, of course, you can say in a tweet, definitely. The person says, um, Omar, imagine what Tacha went through um, in and outside the house. That's why God keeps blessing her. She went through the most. So somebody responds, says, uh, Tacha was the problem. Thank God there are some growth. She was very rude and uncultured. Uh, other people not being blessed. You must be very toxic human being. How come you're watching? You guys said you don't have anything to do with DSTV again. Shame. Okay, she came out herself to respond. So this person says, it's been two years. What do you vampires want from me? Yes, this person didn't come back to maybe give a clap back. But of course, this has been generating a lot of conversations online with people like, really, what do you want from her? It's been two years. Just watch the show and let Tasha be. And of course, she's here to defend herself and just asking, what really do you guys want from Tasha? Yes, this on this note is where I'm saying goodbye. If you're new to Gosso TV, please make sure you click on the subscribe button and as well on the notification bell and the comment section. Just do your thing. We'll be there to respond to some of your comments and I'll see you in the next news. Bye.